Why are application layer attacks so difficult to detect? Application layer DDoS attacks overwhelm specific functions or features of an application or website with the intention to disable those functions or features, resulting in the application not being able to deliver content to the user. These attacks are particularly insidious because they can be very effective with as few as one attacking machine generating a low traffic rate, which makes them very difficult to detect and mitigate. The method used by these attacks is that they typically conform to the protocols the legitimate applications are using, which often involves protocol handshakes and protocol application compliance. An example of this type of attack would be a slow post attack, where the attacker sends legitimate HTTP post headers that are compliant, but the message body is sent at a painfully slow speed. The goal is to keep those connections open for as long as possible to overwhelm and slow the target. Due to the small size of these, these attacks, they will not automatically trigger volumetric monitors employed by cloud scrubbing solutions. Defending against them requires a device that can distinguish between legitimate traffic coming into the network at typical traffic rates and cleverly disguised threats. A comprehensive DDoS protection posture uses a combination of traffic profiling techniques, including the intelligence from an IP reputation database, so it can track and block abnormal activity, while also deploying progressive security challenges to identify source machines and active botnets. This layered defense employing on-premises detection and mitigation, informed by global threat intelligence, and powered by automation is widely considered the best practice for detection and mitigation of all DDoS attacks, including application layer attacks. Successfully detecting and stopping application layer attacks requires intelligent DDoS attack protection at the network edge to maintain the availability of your business critical applications.